job of a marketer is way different from what a sales person's job is we all know that marketing is a bigger picture and sales is just part of it hiring a great marketer can be even more difficult than hiring a great engineer or sales person marketing as a role tends to be amorphous so while it's difficult to pinpoint specific metrics of success in this field you can ask questions that help define the candidates understanding of marketing strategies and how they might approach specific challenges for example if soft skills that are looked as top traits for marketers would be one relationship builder strong marketers should be able to cultivate and foster relationships with everyone they work with both internally as well as externally the second trait that is observed with marketers is they need to be a good storyteller in the digital age effective marketers are glorified storytellers i might sound that a little dramatic but that's the fact one who's able to narrate it very subtly and smoothly those are the glorified storytellers candidates should be capable of crafting a compelling story that educates illuminates and excites so if these three things are kept in mind i'm very sure that the story becomes viable adaptable comes from the sales trait even to marketers Today's marketing landscape is ever evolving so flexibility is key. Find someone who's motivated, curious and interested in exploring new trends of technology. The fourth one is innovative. I don't know if this can be taught. Every job comes with challenges, but someone who can think outside of the box to communicate, create and drive results will be of a great valuable asset the last one is a trait as cultural add look for someone who can add to and more importantly elevate your culture in order to foster inclusion and diversity let's check what would be the possible questions to test or maybe testify all these five parameters in the marketers relationship builder question Tell me about a time when you had to work with a difficult colleague. What did you do to build the relationship? The simple answer could be in my previous role I worked with someone who had a particularly hard time communicating. I made a point to sync up with them outside of presentations, meeting them for lunch, organizing a brainstorming session beyond what what was originally scope for. until we finally got on the same page it helped out back on future rounds of creative presentations and ended up developing our partnership further and what is that one should look at is marketers should be team players look for non verbal cues that a candidate effectively collaborates with teammates most important ever for all the jobs Let's look at the second parameter storyteller. Give me a presentation on a topic you care a lot about. And the sample answer could be, did you know that there are over 7500 people living on the street in our community? I was shocked to hear this number, which is why I began volunteering with a local non-profit organization along with accepting individual donations. the organization throws an annual fundraiser to help raise awareness about the plight of those who are unsheltered and over the years i have held various positions with the organization which has allowed me to utilize my skills to support a cause i care about deeply now what is that which you should look at is search for clues in an answer that make it clear this candidate is a natural conversationalist who can craft a story with a compelling framework that both educates and excites their answer should reveal some expertise 
which will prove that they can passionately advocate for new projects. Let's move on to the next. Adaptability. What could be the question? Tell me about a time when you were asked to do something you had never done before. How did you approach the situation? What did you learn? An answer could be, I love that this industry is always changing and there's always something new to learn. When my company added a new client, I wasn't super familiar with their technology. So I took a couple of online courses well in advance of the project kickoff. So I was up to date on the latest and greatest. I actually like taking on new types of projects. It gives me an excuse to keep learning. And what is that one should listen to is a curious marketer is often a successful one. Listen for phrases like keep learning in a candidate's answer because it shows their willingness to explore new trends, processes and technology. A candidate who is flexible and has the desire to continuously grow their, their skill sets will be an asset to the team. Next question, innovative. The question is, what is the most exciting project or program you have worked on? What was your role and what impact did you have? And the answer could be, in my most recent role, I was a key member of the team who brought to the market a new on-the-go dog treat. I was responsible for leading the external communication launch and packaging designs and worked closely with the counterpart to handle the manufacturing and distribution. The product was purchased by 80% of mainstream retailers and has seen two new iterations. And what is that one should listen to is this candidate should highlight the candidate should highlight how they played an integral role in the project as well as its successes or failures. They should also highlight key insights that are sharp and grounded in methodology. It's important to articulate the pain point and consumer need next question is a cultural ad and the question could be what's the most interesting thing about you that's not on your resume an answer could be in my past life i was uh, while my work took me a lot of places one scenario i'll always remember is is the time i had to administer emergency that is cpr at the beach while on vacation, a young girl was having trouble swimming and without a lifeguard on duty, I stepped into action. This was luckily a one-time event, but I have always been able to stay calm during stressful situation, figure out solutions and act quickly. What a way to answer. And what is that? you one should listen to is a candidate's response should be confident and unique find someone who will add culture and flair to your team not someone who fits the same same mold as other team members look for what gives them joy outside the nine to five job be sure to identify underlying themes that can translate to the work setting passion, tenacity, dedication and creativity. Prepare well now since you know many things do a great justice to your uh, last year of your preparation in your colleges. Invest time and take help of lot of videos and readings like these. I hope this research and survey would have gone a long long way it would definitely go a long long way in preparing yourself best not only for sales for marketers wishing you a great luck